Hi Internet, I'm Tango and these are Tango's Takes. And the take for today, Thursday, May 6, 2021, is... Spirit. Alright. Not... Spirit Ghost. But... Spirits as in... Different, but equal. Um, not separate, but equal. That's a whole other horrible philosophy. This applies a bit more to social connection. If this were a... F if you were in a fantasy setting, a person attuned to spirit would believe that dryads and naiads and centaurs and forest spirits are not necessarily... They're, they're not gods. They're not better than they are. They are simply different and have different abilities and different weaknesses. They have different strengths and different powers. The differences are what make someone, or a group rather, stronger. The strength of a person of spirit is that of a person of community. Or is that of community? Sorry. Wow. Sorry it was a weird day at work. <laughs> But ultimately, spirit is another foundation to something that is life itself. Spirit and faith are, are closely related to each other, but they are not the same thing. A person can be spiritual, but not have a lot of faith. A person can be very strong in faith, but not very spiritual. Though, that is unusual. Ultimately, like I said, yeah, spirit draws strength from community, from the differences. We are stronger because of our differences, as long as we work together. So, it's time to bring up Wild again. And we've seen life. And we've seen faith. It should not surprise anybody that spirit goes there. Spirit is closer to a balanced thing than an orderly thing. Arguably, spirit is closer to chaos, but you'll notice they're technically equal, equidistant in a straight line. They're even equidistant if you go around the sides, honestly. Neither one of those is associated with chaos. But they stand one closer to order than to balance between order and chaos, and the other one stands closer to balance than order. Stay safe and healthy out there, folks. And I'll catch you all next time.